Hello, welcome back. I'm Shain Vinayak Goswami and in this video we are going to understand what are deformers, what is the basic structure for writing a deformer and to understand that we would write a basic or simple deformer which is a ripple deformer or the wave deformer and later on we would add the features to our deformer and we would make our algorithm a little bit more complexer. So let's get started. First, what is a deformer? Deformer is a dependency graph node which takes one or more than one geometry as an input. Apply an algorithm and gives us the result or the output. So as we know that deformer are the dependency graph node and the way we would write it, we, the way we would write the code for it will also be very similar to the way we write, wrote the dependency graph node or the custom nodes. So what is a difference between deformer and writing a custom node or the dependency graph node? So when we write a dependency graph node, empty node is generated and then we add the attributes to it then we design the circuitry and then we write an algorithm or the function to perform the calculation for the dependency graph node so this is the input input 2 input 3 and output right but when we create the deformer node it comes with certain predefined inputs certain functions inside it function 1 function 2 and an output node and now we would take a deeper look at those predefined or the more accurate term is already existing attributes and the functions so when a deformer node is created this is the structure of a deformer node there is an input which is an array of input it's a complex attribute which would have further sub attributes the second one is weight attribute which is also an array of attribute and then there is an envelope and then there is a output attribute which is output geom which stands for output geometry and again I can delete this one so this is not an attribute now we would take a look at what are these array of inputs and this is one of the important attribute which we are going to use a lot while writing a deformer algorithm and it also the deformer node also can